Hi guys, so I recently picked up the new Wet n Wild Spring Collection. I wanted to share this collection with you guys because it is super adorable. I love the color scheme, it's very pastel, very uh, Easter-like colors, and I just, I absolutely love it. So I wanted to share uh, the things that I picked up from this collection. So there is two little trios in this collection, and this one is to Indio I Go Go. <laughs> And this one has a beautiful shimmering, like peachy champagne color. It is gorgeous. It's a little bit on the chunkier side because it does have glitter, but it is beautiful on the inner corner. And then you have this matte shade right here, which is a purple. It's not very pigmented. Uh, you do have to build it up. It's not my favorite color in this little trio, but uh, it does work with a little color scheme that is going on. And then there's this beautiful sky blue. This does have a shimmer to it. And you do also have to pack on this color as well. It is the color that is on my lids and it is just gorgeous. Now, I don't think that these shadows are meant to be very pigmented because this collection is meant to be very soft, very spring-like, very girly. Overall, this does make a really pretty eyeshadow look. So the next little trio is called The New Romantic. <laughs> And this one has a beautiful pearlescent brow bone shade. It has like a white pearlescent shade and it is just gorgeous. It is perfect for the inner corner, for the brow bone, and also you can use this as a highlight. And then it has the shade right here which is a shimmery pink and then you have a shimmery purple. And this quad is quite pigmented. It is quite metallic. This will also give you a very soft look and it's a statement but not like an overstatement. It's not super pigmented but it does have some color. You will see the different colors, the different dimensions, uh, but it's not in your face which is nice. also came out with really pretty colors in their Wet n Wild Mega Liner collection and this one is in the shade Trim with Lace which is a beautiful milky white and then this one is a case of blue which is is a beautiful periwinkle shade and then you have this one which is called violet revolution and this is more of like a bubblegum pink and I think this one is probably my favorite because it is the most unique I do like periwinkle I have a couple periwinkle liquid eyeliners already because it's one of these colors that are just gorgeous on the eyes but I don't have anything like this so uh, I definitely recommend this shade and I like the applicator of this because the applicator is stiff, so you will get a pretty precise line. And these are very, very pigmented. They are quite liquidy in formula, so you do have to be careful with that. But nonetheless, they do dry rather quickly and uh, they show up really nicely on your eyes and they will look so beautiful with the eyeshadows that go with this collection. And last but certainly not least are the highlighters in this collection. This is what definitely drew me to this collection. Damn. there are three highlighters. So this one is Desert Explorations and these are called the Geometric Highlighting Powders. So they do have this really pretty geometric shape to them and these are quite nice. They're not super powdery which I like. Uh, so this one is like a rosy pearlescent shade and this one is Sun Ceremony. Sun Ceremony is like a bronzier golden kind of shade it's not overly you know bronzed so you can wear this as a highlighter it's like a yellow gold and then lastly there's this one this one is called where the dreamers go i think that is such a beautiful name the colors are just gorgeous you have like a pale pink a pale blue you have some golden shades as well and mixed together it just makes a really beautiful pearlescent shade it's like a pearlescent white I feel like this is the highlight that is going to show up the most on the skin it gives a beautiful beautiful glow the other ones I feel like are going to be best for a medium complexion but nonetheless they are gorgeous as well so uh, that is the spring collection I also picked up the uh, rose champagne blush this is in their permanent line I 
have heard nothing but great things about this blush so I wanted to give it a try and I will say this is a beautiful beautiful blush it gives you a really nice rosy bronzy cheek which I love I love these types of tones on my cheeks I will say that the texture of these are super super silky they're very smooth uh, this isn't a chalky blush like their older formula which I love it's not super super powdery which I love as well uh, but I will say that these blushes aren't as pigmented as their older formula which is okay you definitely have to build this up if you have a medium complexion I think that this will be an outstanding blush if you have a lighter complexion but nonetheless I really do like this blush a lot they have launched so many new products in their permanent line which is amazing so I definitely want to try out some of those products I did try out the concealer which I love and I tried out their blush which I love as well so I definitely want to try out their blushes their blushes look really really pretty um, and very affordable so uh, that's all for today I hope that you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you guys in the next one bye guys